guys welcome back to the channel and another vlog as you can see we are out in the trailer um, that is because we have headed over to Beechwood for a jump lesson with Jonathan um, it's been a little while since I've had a jump lesson so I'm really really looking forward to it uh, Fred hasn't jumped since we went to the cross country that you saw in the vlog last time um, he has however been out and done a bit of dressage and he's already qualified for the winter area festivals um, at novice level so yeah he's been a really really good boy he's feeling really good um so yeah let's see how today goes rob is coming over to film the lesson so that'll be good you can see everything and uh yeah hopefully it's good and hopefully you enjoy it see you in a bit so just before i tack up i thought i would give you a quick little look at Fredos because it's been ages since you've seen him without tack on. Um, he is looking super duper, a little bit scraggly because he is actually still out at night um, and it's rather muddy and rather cold, isn't it, mate? Uh, so yeah, he's a bit muddy and furry, but he looks fabulous. Uh, top line and weight wise, he looks great. Still nice and shiny, even though that winter coat's coming, isn't it, mate? Should we get you ready? Yeah? says yeah whatever <laughs> that's it you have a snack and i'll get your tack ready right i'll see you in the arena freddles and i are just having a little wander in the sun because for the first time in forever we're actually running early and look who's arrived robert oh. say hello, hello. <laughs> he's a uh, Absolutely buzzing to do some filming, aren't you, Rob? You excited? Barely contain myself. Yeah, that's what we thought, isn't it, Fred? <laughs> right, let's go find out what arena we're in. <laughs> Rude. Find out what arena we're in and uh, go have some fun. Yes? Good boy. Come on then. So, rule one of going in canter as we wait for a corner, yeah. I want you to ask him on a straight line. Yeah. It's much harder, isn't it? Can you do the same thing again? Do the shot again? You might have to do a little bit more preparation, a little bit more picking up, yeah. but still as straight as you can in the middle of that canter. Because of um, 
momentum and drift, it's easy for them to want to drift back towards the track after you've gone over the course. Yeah, yeah, totally. They're more inclined to want to pick up the wrong lead. Again, it's about keeping yourself down this right side. You might say, well, I don't feel straight because I'm right off this side, but that's how far you're able to go to keep them straight, basically. Okay. Okay, you can relax.
of the bike, they barely touched it. And it just stops it from sort of spinning out that way, yeah. or from going up. Sometimes you'll sit down and you won't even notice. Yeah. Sometimes you'll sit down and you'll cramp up and you'll go, bitch, what's your yeah. So exactly the same thing, we put a little back row on this one. And then after we've done that line, we're going to do the black and red one. See you've gone on a big powerful stride and left it massively made sparks on his land. Yeah. What what you have not at that moment you've isolated it from your emotions. So you, you haven't noticed you won't remember the fact that you're about to do that thing first, so you want to make sure it's a good one. So at Radley Green, when you got hold of him, looking at the video, emotionless at home on the sofa, it's completely different to being there and experiencing. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. I would tell you if I thought you were hanging on. Okay, good. So chop the cross pole. Yep. Landing left hand. Jump that. Yep. Land the right. Yep. Jump that. Jump that. Yep. Land the right. Jump that. Yep. Land the left. Jump that. Yep. Land the right. Jump this. Got it. Okay. Yep. Try not to press the bush button. And if you do, you've got to work a bit harder to go. Could be broke, you know, you have to have a sports button. Might as well just pick up the candle now and start again. Okay. Cold toilet seat. That's good. Okay, the organisation. Good. Let 
Good. Hold down. There you go. Loads of time. Nice and calm. Blue one with the fillers. Good. Go on. The blue one near you, yeah? Yeah, that's it. Brain contact and horses' mouths, especially horses like him, they're a very interactive thing. Yeah. We can end up having to do more because we've just done it before. So if we take, go a bit tighter on, we can end up having to pull more. The majority of that would be exactly how you want it to. Got yourself a bit up tight around here, got that bit of but uh, if not, it's certainly going that way. Yeah. If, gone, if your hands are holding it, strap your arm up there. Then you can't at the top and it's fine. Yeah. It's not what you wanted at the red and black. You can get any room faster. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah. No. You are? No, I'm not. <laughs> you look like you are. Oh. That was so good. Did you like it, Rob? Well? I was busy getting cramp in my thumb knuckle. Oh, yeah. but. Yeah, hang on. I've got shorter legs. <laughs> no, that was brilliant. Um, really, really, really happy with that. I uh, didn't get scared. I'm afraid I actually jumped really nicely. And I think the bridle, if you just hang around, um, I've taken the Miklum off, which obviously has the strap around his nose. I have no idea what that is. Um, I'm telling the camera, aren't you? I know. <laughs> um, and I've changed it just to the Carlton, and he was way less fighty as well. Um, yeah, I felt like I made a really, really good shape over the jobs. No sign of it hurting whatsoever. I clearly enjoyed it, sir. So I am very, very happy with how that went. Really glad. And a set of promises that I must have a job lesson at least once a month. Every month for the winter. And what, what are you going to and what you gonna get rid of? Huh? What are you going to get rid of? Nothing. <laughs> well, I won't be doing many shows because we've qualified for the areas. So I don't need to go to shows so I can have lessons instead. Definitely worthwhile coming. Had the best time, really enjoyed myself, and so did you, didn't you? So, I think the boy needs a bit of a wash up, and then we'll take him home and put him in the field. Yeah, side A. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> poor horse. Wicked. Thanks very Yeah, boy, let it out. Just like I to see. <laughs> Jesus, that reeks, honestly. <laughs> Woo! I'm going to stand upwind of that. He's a good egg, taking Fred for a walk to dry off while I pick up the poop. I think he's just got dragged to some grass. <laughs> Look at him watching me. Too funny. Thanks, Rob. I'll go and see to that. Delightful. Alrighty, guys. So we are back at the ranch. Uh, as you can see, Mr. Freddles is in his field. Macy is in her field. It's actually a lot darker than it looks on the camera. Um, I've made it just before it gets dark, which is great. Um, I'm still absolutely buzzing from my lesson um, over the moon. I really enjoyed myself and pretty sure he did too. So hopefully there'll be a lot more of that to come over the winter. 
Um, like I said earlier, my goal is to get out and do a fair bit of training um, just to build my confidence up, build him up a bit um, and yeah, see where it takes us. We shall see, but no, really positive after today. Um, had the best time, loved it. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching um, and listening to the lesson. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and of course, subscribe to the channel for more fun with Seth Riddles and Macy. <laughs> see you real soon. Bye.